So Chris, the last question I have for you, why did the company succeed? Because let's be honest, most companies, they fail. You're in the small minority of businesses that make it. So what were the ingredients in that success? Honestly, I think there's an element of luck to it, but there's a few aspects, I think. From an engineering perspective, we all had the same kind of mindset. We weren't going to hack stuff. You know, we would do it properly. We were going to take advantage of all of the kind of the really cool stuff that, you know, we'd seen um, done elsewhere, reading, you know, articles and listening to podcasts online and stuff. Um, we wanted to bake all of that stuff into the product. And I think that gave us a really great foundation to build everything on. But from a team perspective, I think, We've just had to be continuously vigilant to kind of problems as they emerge and, and just be reactive to those. Every six to 12 months, you could just see the, you know, the wheels starting to wobble on, on something somewhere, whether it's processes that we're using, you know, which teams looking after which components, culture and things as the company grew. We just had to kind of stay continuously on top of all of that stuff and just be ready to kind of jump in and kind of not be afraid to change stuff, you know, 